So just for my memory, black goes to ground, brown goes to dat, red goes to CLK, all right? Then on this side, we got black goes to ground, red goes to SWDIO, and brown goes to CLK. So basically, the CLK and DAT are reversed, and ground goes to ground. So. <clears throat> So and if anyone's looking to run FPV, these little TX, TX02, I think is what this one is, um, I just soldered it onto the other end of the battery. So it works super fun. Fly this little guy around with goggles. So... I, like you guys, probably had a lot of trouble flashing my blue board. Um, I'm not into programming, don't write code, so some of the stuff that came up is was kind of confusing, and I think I figured it out. So, um... So once I, sorry, so I opened the STM utility, uh, I went to target, and I erased the chip, right? Then I just minimized that, and opened up Keel, right? I <clears throat> opened a new project. And then I went in and found the zip file, well, the extracted file for the blue chip. Um, you can see up at the top, it says HA Mini Blue Board Master, and then I went into Silverware, and then you pick the one, it's an Uprox Jox file, a Projects file, um, but it will be in there. I'm sure you guys got this far. So my next step was I wanted to tune it a little bit. And honestly, when going through this, it was just so confusing. Um, I've never really looked at code or done any of that. So I found this guy on YouTube who was telling me that change his rate to 600 and the rate you ought to 440. You can actually just, I forget what numbers these were, but I just typed in 600 and 440. All right. Um, and then there is the Silver Vice app that I wanted to work. And... In the description, oh, I also deleted the two, um, the two slashes right here to define new stock uh, trans transmitter. Um, I'm not using Devo; I'm just using the little stock guy. So I erase those so that it defines that. I figured out that when you delete these guys, that means it it enables it. So you can see anything that is in yellow is the code that's going to go through. I, this is what I feel has worked. I also changed the frequency from 8,000 I added two there and then deleted the two next to the 16,000 uh, I haven't flown it yet but it flashed so um, we'll see how that goes alright then we get here the telemetry was the one that was highlighted 
And then I wanted to use the Silver Vice app. So, per the instructions, Silver Vice, I was looking at this and I thought, you know, I was just looking and I couldn't figure out what the heck all this shit meant. It was kind of confusing. So, after I figured out that the yellow is what actually gets loaded, I was able to put it finally together. I felt like an idiot. Um, and so that one works. I actually opened it and uh, the app worked. So, um, also in the explanation, it tells you that you have to go to the BLE app. So you can see I already have that one opened as well. And then you just have to define the name. It automatically said H8 Blue. I put a one there just in case I get another one of these things. They're pretty fun. So I went to Project and then Build Target. It goes through a bunch of things there. Hopefully it says no errors. And then you download it. And it should flash. You just have to make sure the battery is in. And, I mean, that obviously should be connected. But it works. So, I'm super stoked. I hope this helps some other people. Because that shit was super frustrating.